I teach industrial technology at Castro Valley Unified School District at Canyon Middle School in Castro Valley. My fellowship this past summer at Fujifilm Dymatics, they asked me to look at shift-to-shift -shift communication and consistency. So they had four shifts that went 12 hours with a half an hour overlap, and I needed to see how that worked and how I could hopefully gather information from that and make it work more seamlessly. My educational transfer plan is designed to teach communication and collaboration between two different periods that are doing identical projects, but now they must work together by sharing communication via a pass down paper, which is emulating what, what took place at Fujifilm Dymatics. I took my experience at Fujifilm and then took an existing plan that I already had where students built a modular toothpick design and I had two separate classes working on it and now I decided well I want these classes to work together and they have to pass down information on the same project but they're now working collaboratively together going back and forth each day uh, trying to continually build on the project only through written communication. Uh, today we were doing our project with uh, toothpicks and we we're making pyramids in our groups with triangles and squares. My favorite part was to work together with my group and to build an awesome project. This lesson teaches us that teamwork and communication is important for our project to be successful. The class before us leaves um, a slip that tells us what to do. I was trying to make a pyramid and the square was supposed to go around it that way. Um, when we have our competition, it'll be stronger and stay up. During the competition, we have to put our modules on a table, and if they, got, they get shot at, and if they get knocked down, then we lose points, and the people who shot it get the points. I learned that good communication means um, writing it in complete sentences and telling what you've actually done and what you want us to do. If the communication is right, then everything will get done a lot smoother. I've noticed that the students, they're really thinking about the process, whereas before, you know, they would make the project, they would get frustrated, and, you know, they, they wouldn't understand the why. And now, you know, it's built into a bigger context of, you know, okay, we're making the modules. Oh, Fujifilm makes modules. Oh, this is what a module is. And now it fits into a bigger context, which before I couldn't really tie it into anything, although I knew that it was important for them to do it. Now I really know why it's important for them to do it. And I think they're starting to catch on as to why it's important as well. I think this experience overall has been unlike anything else I've experienced in my 23 years of teaching. This transformed the conversations I was having with students. It's been sort of a paradigm shift of, of the way I've been doing teaching. So I can see it being more of a global shift in what I do versus just another tool or technique uh, adding into what I do with teaching.